Good morning. Just going to the office. Oh, I got a coffee. Yeah, an espresso. They're fancy. We got some muscle milk, protein, and some almond milk frothing. because it was I overflowed it a little bit it's pretty good probably could have used a little bit extra sweet or like a little bit less milk kind of one or two or one or the other but I will enjoy right, what are we doing here oh you're like black lit got day 21 day 21 what could it be I think you're right it's got to be a gift card you already open it Target Ooh. Ooh! Stop and discover. <laughs> Do I take yours? Sure. You can take both, actually. <laughs> you both have to buy stocking stuffers, don't you? <laughs> yeah. I'll buy myself stocking stuffers with my ten dollars. All right, folks. Time to get the beer for the day. Let's see what it is. I hear it's a good one. Are you coming with? Yeah, I'm gonna grab a beer. Oh, that's fair. Ooh. Oh, the light is on. Alright, oh, my feet are cold. Alright, it's the 21st, yeah? yeah? Let's see what we got here. Oh! I knew it was Maplewood. Look what else I have here. Look! There's another one! <laughs> Awesome. This will be good. I'm excited for Hello, this. Hello everybody and welcome to day 21 of the Bitter Pops advent calendar. We've had a Monday here. It's been a hectic day working from home, working remotely from my remote location. Um, but it's been a productive day so that's good. So that means it's time for a beer, which is even better. And the beer today is Royal Tannenbaum from Maplewood. It's a festive red ale. Got a pretty cute can here. We've got, I'm like lit by a candle over here, so there's like a glow. Um, there's also lights, but also a candle. Um, but I really like the little trees and stuff. It's so cute and aesthetic. So, as I said, it's a festive red ale. 6.6% um, ABV. So it's an ale brewed with spruce tips, Chinook Cairo, and Chinook Cryo, and Cascade Cryo. Um, that looks like kind of what we have here. And uh, full disclosure, I have in fact had this beer before. I think I've had three of them. I think I had a four pack and there was one still out there to be consumed. So I have drank this before, but it's been, you know, maybe a week or so. So let's see how it's tasting. Got my same phase three glass left from yesterday because well, it's cute and it's festive and why not? Also, I feel like the little like geometric trees also go quite well with the with the maple wood can. I should fill this up quite nicely. Oh, I got it too foamy. Oh. That's why we should pour this first. Oh well. Oh, yeah, it's dark. It's so, it's, I mean, it's a red ale. So there's a little bit of a, wait, you can see here. Oh, I don't know if you can see the candle, but it's definitely got a red tint to it. I think you can see that like there's mm -hmm. on the camera from like the Christmas lights coming through. Um, so yes, it's pretty dark. And from what I remember, it's pretty, like, malty. Um, I just, I love Maplewood. Um, they've got their little ble be fluid, their little slogan here. So, let's, uh, it's kind of dissipated enough, I think. Oh, I wanted to say, oh, you can't really see. It's too much foam. You can kind of tell, though. The, like, geometric trees, though. I feel like it goes well. It goes really cutely together. So, let's take a sip. Hmm. Yeah, so very like malty, I think is the main thing, like a roasty kind of deeper, darker malt. And then you get the kind of like spruce tip, like foresty kind of flavor. Um, it's not very like hoppy or anything like that. 
but it's quite tasty. It does have some bitterness, kind of. It does have bitterness, kind of, towards the end. I don't know what Chinook and Cascade, like, bring to the picture. I don't know if they are particularly, like, you know, like, foresty, like, grassy, any kind, kind of hops or anything like that. But I'll say it's brewed with spruce tips. Um, which is kind of a good, I would call it, like, kind of, like, a winter warmer kind of beer. Um, without all of the extra, like, spices, I feel like, that we often... We often have in like Christmassy or winter beers. And I will say I think this has been sold out for a while, so I don't know that you can get it anymore, unfortunately. Um, but it's a good one, a good festive beer to have on hand, um, especially for the season here as it's cold and blustery and wintry and whatnot. Um, but yeah, I think that's kind of all I have to say for today. Um, we have only a few more days left of the calendar, which is kind of sad, but we're going to make it. We're going to do it. So that's exciting. Um, and until next time, I'll see you guys tomorrow. And until then, drink fresh beer. You want to be on the vlog? No. Hey, I'm famous already. I'm, I'm like from Canada, eh? <laughs> we're good for this year.